Caleb, I was telling the truth. It was just an accident. You and Grandma have enough to deal with. I understand you want to hide it from Gran. We've caused her enough trouble since she brought us up together. Now that she's older, it wouldn't be a good idea to make her anxious. But why do you have to hide it from me? Can't you trust me now that we're all grown up? I don't want you worrying about me. It's not often you get to come home these days, so ruining the mood is the last thing I want to do. Also, I'm a grown-up now. I need to be the one making sure I stay safe. You can't protect me forever. <sighs> Why is that a problem? If not me, who could you possibly turn to if... <sighs> What's wrong? You wouldn't understand even if I told you, Pipsqueak. Forget it. Hmm. We've been outside for too long. Grant's gonna be worried. You're doing it again. Go inside by yourself. I'm not your sidekick. Fine. But uh, hide the blood on your sleeve before heading inside. Since you're a grown-up now, I won't cover for you this time. After an injection of protocore energy, the success rate of clinical treatments dramatically improves. In other news, in recent months, the number of wanderers in Lincoln has increased due to the fluctuations of Metaflux. Metaflux-related explosions have currently left 35 people wounded with two casualties in Bloomshore District. We advise all citizens to be careful. Uh, what are you doing here? I thought you were out on a mission again. Yeah, I'll clock out soon. I just finished reading these reports. I'll turn them in in a second. You're working so hard. Handling all these missions and investigating Metaflux incidents? I refuse to believe what happened to me was just an accident. I'm worried about you. How about... We grab something to eat. My treat. Captain! I'll send you the report soon. Thank you. I just got one about a protocol analysis. Who sent it? Oh, yes. Sorry about that. That was uh, me. You okay? Uh, I bet you haven't gotten enough sleep. Rest. And don't be too hard on yourself. I'm fine, Tara. Besides, I wouldn't dare fall asleep when... Hi there. Just calling to remind you, you have an appointment today. Dr. Grayson? You had a transapical metaflux ablation last month, right? Dr. Zane has your medical report, but you'll need to get an evolved cardiac examination first. Okay. Zane... He'll be worried if I don't go. Captain, I Take care of your health first. Then, you'll have the energy to do other things.
These are the results of your medical examination. Everything is ready for you. You can visit your doctor now. Hello, um, my doctor is Dr. Zane. Is he available right now? Follow me. Because of the recent Wanderer attacks, Dr. Zane has been working overtime. Emergency operation in OR3. Call Grayson, stat. On it. Patient is elderly male. Prepare the pump for cardiopulmonary bypass. Yes, of course. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. He's just very busy right now. Can you wait here for a bit if you're not in a hurry? It's fine. The operation is more important. Thank you. Leading expert in the study of Protocor Syndrome, appointed chief surgeon. Zane must be working overtime right now because more wanderers are attacking people. Oh, our shift's finally over. Do you want to get some hot pot? Oh, can't. I promised my granny we'd have dinner together later. Why the long face, Pipsqueak? I'm just going to Aerospace Academy. Shouldn't you be happy? But it's all the way in Skyhaven. What if I suddenly crave your braised chicken wings? Oh, don't be too sad. He'll be back for the holidays. And when he is, I'll make him cook for you every day. Which means there's a reward for being your free personal chef. What is it? A send-off gift? Who says Don't I think I you. haven't noticed you being all sneaky these past few days. I know what you've been doing. Caleb, that's cheating. You can't just use your evil to take it. <laughs> I knew it'd be in a style you really like. Won't you put it on for me? No way. Don't you have hands? No, I don't. Hurry, the train is about to leave. If I see it's not with you next time, you'll be sorry. <laughs> 